protecting us in our town. If you come in our town, this is our community. If you disrespect us, you got to go. We don't want your chicken. We don't want your fries. We don't want nothing to do with you. So we are disrespecting us as a black people. It is just common for them to do. His words were stupid nigga. If you call me a stupid nigga, I will be relentless to make sure that your story is moved out of our city. This is bumping on between a beautiful city. Hey, your name is uh, Lewis, uh, my brother, Mel. Uh, you know, we're here right now with defendants that are not racist at all. Yeah, I love blacks. Uh, I have, most of my friends are black. Uh, I have nothing against nobody. We are proud black people. If you come in our neighborhoods and you disrespect us or you call us by that name, we will not support you. We are going to stand against anybody that comes in our neighborhood, takes our money out of our neighborhood, they don't support our neighborhood. You will not speak to us and call us that name or we will shut you down. We closing these stores in our community because we are proud black people and we stand for Someone got caught a nigger? Uh, I, didn't, I don't know if that's true. I don't know if he's being called a nigger, whatever it is. The case is, I wasn't there. The best person tells us my brother. The case is what happened. From what I know, they both got in a hurry. He said something to him. And he said something to him. We are not going to uh, uh, do anything on this. But we will. We're going to stay here every day until snap of the shutdown in front of this. Job site. 
I'm not over by his store. I'm on my job site doing the job that I was contracted out to do. I didn't ask him no questions. He shouldn't have been over there. I, I wouldn't have been over there. And this incident wouldn't have happened. I think that these guys have become so frequent with disrespecting us as a black people to it's just common for them to do it. His words were stupid nigga. If you call me a stupid nigga, I will be relentless to make sure that your store is moved out of our city. This is Pompano Beach. We're a beautiful city. We have some great, it's a great community. But if you use that name, the only thing we, I will stop, I won't stop until you cut your lights off, pack up your refrigerators, and back up a truck and take your Kool-Aid and your chicken out of Pompano. And that, I won't stop until Snappers is packed up on the back of a truck and moving out of Pompano. I will be there every day in the morning, in the rain, in the snow. Went to all the to every day until they move out of Pompano. And that's my story. Democracy is hypocrisy. Right. If democracy means freedom, why aren't our people free? Right. If democracy means justice, why don't we have justice? Right. If democracy means equality, why don't we have equality? From my black nation. Yeah. Come on. This is for my black people, my black heroes, and all my pioneers. Huh. Like Madam C.J. Walker, who invented the code, put the swag in your culture. Have no critics, then you have no success. Learn from the best, R.I.P. Malcolm X. The truth is on the side of the oppressed. And Louis Farrakhan was politically correct when he stated they got a plan going against us blacks. Huh. And little nigga, and that's a fact, so let me take it back to the great Dr. Martin Luther. He had a dream. He seen the future, but they assassinated him like they did pop racism. Is yet to stop. So I'm screaming out, Hail Mary, white man's word, no tail fairy. Freedom ain't free, it's the song I sing. Let my people go and let freedom ring. I say, Freedom ain't free, it's the song I sing. Let my people go and let freedom ring. Come on. It's my letter to the president. Motherfuck the government. Don't give a damn about no politics. Black people is what I represent. It's my letter to the president. Motherfuck the government. Don't give a damn about no politics. Black people, it's time to represent. This my letter to the president. Motherfuck the government. Don't give a damn about no politics. Black people, it's time to represent. This is for my black people, the black activists, and all my black leaders. Like Miss Mary McLeod Bethune, believed in black education, started a black school. I saw my leg, blessed to the nation. Stop, I say to all my Haitians, why go on? To my Jamaicans, believe in black people and black communication. We gotta take back our black communities. We can do it together, nigga. You and me, call me a racist. I don't give a fuck. 492 years they enslaved us. Now that's some shit that you can't make up. Land of the free, that's some shit y'all made up. Four to six million living in poverty. Damn, where's the camaraderie? But black's what I'm proud to be. So I'ma give it to you, cracker straight BET. Black entertainer, black entertainment. Being a black man, can't even explain it. But they think my black's dangerous Make these land laws just to lock my black in cages White neighborhoods, black neighborhoods Damn, all I see is segregation But this my letter to the president ha. Motherfuck the government Don't give a damn about no politics Black people is what I represent This is American justice right. This is American democracy right. And those of you who are familiar with it yes. Know that in America, democracy is hypocrisy right. Right. Now if I'm wrong, put me in jail but if you can't prove that if democracy is not hypocrisy, then don't put your hands on me. On me.